just got started today. Probably been on the trail like 45 minutes or so, about about a mile or so. We got to uh, <clears throat> we got to our spot where we hike in a little early. We normally would spend the night and start in the morning, but it's so nice out here. We said, uh, fuck it, let's go. So, uh, hitting the trail up, trying to get an extra day. See if we can't get to the base of the mountains before we can uh, climb up. First campsite had a big fuck up. We uh, actually went up the wrong drainage compared to the one we were gonna do, the one that we did last year. We went to a previous one, so now we're gonna have to do an extra climb up and over something that we maybe didn't have to do, but it's all gonna lead us to the same spot. So we're trying to be positive about it. Um, you know. That's what happens when you don't look at the map and you think you know where you're going, but you don't. <laughs> but if you don't know, now you know. If you don't know, now you know. <laughs> That's fucking right. shit spot and now we're having to traverse the back side of it here hopefully we can get up and over to where we're trying to go just a slight detour you know just a little bit of detour action huh brando a little audible a little audible got up to the line and uh Defense said otherwise, so we're, uh, we're in the middle of that uh, change of plans, but we're picking our way back in there to the promised land. Yeah. Was there socks or what are you? Got some exercise today, huh? Oh my gosh. Jeez, dude. Up and over. How many miles? Up and over and down. So we did a total of six in the last 24 hours. They're hard. Up and so it's three miles last night to whiskey camp. And then we did three miles between climbing up a mile, over a mile, down a mile. It's, and a mile's not a lot Man, that in the grand scheme, but the the, the trekking of the mileage is yeah, so makes rocky. it feel like 20. Yeah. <laughs> Spiders are barking. Well, 
day two, maybe day three. Um, we had to go from way that farthest thing you say, way back there, up over that first saddle, came down, came down to this uh, creek bottom back there, climbing all the way up this thing now to get up to the heavens. Finally get in sheep country, um, corrected our mistake, and uh, we're on our way now. Up to the top, baby, up to the tizzy. Stop and have a little lunch. Spotted some uh, a couple rams over the other side, pretty far away. Not really the way we were gonna go, um, but we'll keep an eye on them. Have a little morsel, and then uh, a little break after that haul up this bitch, and then. Uh, packs back on and go that way and see what we can find. If you go, oh yeah, three rams. Okay, so if you look at the jagged peak rock, oh, two, with the sun no, no, on it. no, two rams, one small one. Cisco, where? Okay, so. Okay, remember we were talking about those rocks that we thought there was a buttload of fucking sheep over there on the far hill over there. So there's one, then two, and then it's in the sun right now. Okay. So if you go straight out like that. And look where the sun's beaming. Okay. On the flats, you'll see three, two rams, one oh, ewe. Okay. You can tell they're rams, dude. I seen the hor horns. Yeah, I seen the horns on one. And he's eating right now, head down. They're cro they're cropping right. But the one with his head down, you can see the horns. Oh, okay. I see them. Sure they did. That's far. <laughs> That's far. <full. laughs> 
we are oh yeah about 25 miles or so total hiked and we're uh, in our third descent down and uh, getting ready to go back up again we dropped about 2,000 feet there maybe a thousand foot at least we dropped 1,100 feet, er, 1, feet. feet yep. yep just climb another thousand seen lots of sheep yesterday spotted some more today we're actually uh, in the direction of what we believe is one ram for sure might be a small band um, climb up here get some water and see what we can find these are awesome <laughs> It's tiring, real tiring. Sat there and fucking got a little poop out. Sat there longer, got another little poop out. Sat there another four minutes. temperature drop from yesterday. Oh yeah, bud. A little footage. Morning. Morning. It's 8.36. It's Sunday the 23rd. A little late start today, huh? A little oh. bit. Yeah. My body needed it. Yeah, we've been going hard the last three days. Hard, hard, hard. Almost 30 miles of hiking. Man, and not just on a nice trail, huh? Yeah. Well, do you know, just a couple thousand here up and down. <laughs> uh, yeah, I'm, uh, my body needed rest last night. I feel pretty good, though. A couple thousand. No, I'm just saying thousand down, thousand up, thousand down, thousand up. At least the one day before was two thousand up. Big, big ramp. Yeah. I think we dropped a thousand yesterday, and then probably climbed roughly a thousand back up here. Maybe, maybe a little less, because it was that gradual slope. It got pretty steep here at the end, though. And then climbing around over around the bowls here. Starting to get stronger though. In mountain shape. Got another push today. Drop down into the drainage. Hopefully there's some sheep in there. Seen lots of them. Lots of lambs, lots of ewes, lots of little rams, little young rams. Maybe two year olds. I'm not sure. There's little like quarter pearls. Nothing legal yet, huh? Mm -mm. No, I think we're 
sure we've probably seen 50, 60 of sheep so far. But just haven't found the big boys yet. But not discouraged. Just know you got to be patient with this game. And you got to keep looking and keep exploring. And before you know it, there'll be a band hiding behind some rocks laying down in the sun one day. And all of a sudden you got extra 100 pounds to pack around. <laughs> Can't wait. You know? happens just like that then you forget about all this hard work and almost uh i don't know if despair is the right word but after three or four days and discouragement yeah you just you feel defeated and but then you got to realize you got you know four or five days of your hunt left and there's more time and Again, you just got to be patient, and your time will come when if the time, when the time is right. But we're gonna will our way to a sheep. <laughs> oh, is that coffee ready? Coffee time. Oh. Oh, yeah, I'm gonna start your day off with a good cup of joe. Yeah. A little bit cloudy, a little bit foggy up here at 6,000. Shot here. What's up, DB? You filming me or yourself? I'm filming you. Do I look good? You look real good. How do you feel? Sore. Yeah. Backyotomy? I need a full backyotomy. <laughs> <laughs> he was just living with pain just all day, every day. But, yeah. Uh, That's what's up. How's my beard look today? Great. Got a good bath over there in the creek, dude. Got that to. was uh, everything a man needed right there. Yeah. Oh, hey, oh, hey, 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 hey. Straight up. Hey, Look at that. I almost kind of forgot that was up there. You see that? Yeah, right up there? I, know. I thought you had some kind of holder going on there. Mm -mm. Just full risky. Risky business. Day six. Got a little weathered in this morning. Lots of fog and rain last night cleared up so we just decided to go over this see what's up on the other side I think it's gonna be like our seventh drainage eighth drainage looking in our fourth or fifth up and over into a new valley um, I ran into a guy Blake nice to meet you buddy looked like he was uh, clapped out devastated just been hiking for days soldier Kansas boy, soldier, good for him.
but uh weather cleared up real nice and i think that we're going to be able to go over the top of this thing up here and hopefully find our rams feel good legs feel good knee feels better back was a little fucked up from that where we slept but it's all good so we'll see what's on the other side here made it up to the top to look over that next drainage and didn't see much but pretty cool spot that we were in from this side <clears throat> overlook kind of where uh, Brandon and Scott went today they went down this way to look up in these hills but we can see some of them from this angle too I sit up here all day and uh Hopefully something comes out. Pop his head on this side or that side. Make a play. We'll see. got to the uh, fourth valley we're calling it um, didn't see absolutely anything in there <sighs> pretty much a bummer but beautiful day it's absolute silence Ravens squawking over there. Golden eagles flying by. Saw lots of sheep, just none. None were rams, big rams. Old enough rams. But, you know, it's, you still take the trip as a positive, you know, because you were able to get a full reset on life and everything that's going on at home and work and all the stress that that brings along and just to come out here for 10 days I mean <clears throat> we're only on our sixth day but three of those days are exit days you know it's gonna take us at least three or four days to get out from where we are and but you still look at it like a positive I mean it was beautiful beautiful amazing to be out here and just in this solitude and you know, for me to go, if people have been thinking about wanting to do this kind of stuff, like, man, just get the best gear you can get, pick a place to go, and go, and just go and push and push and push and push. I mean, if I can do it, I've had four knee surgeries on the same knee. I have to have a full knee replacement probably this Christmas. And if I can do it and live through it and go through that pain and every day get up and go over another mountain and go down into another valley, then anybody can do it. I mean, get on it. If you want to do it, get on it.
see him, see him. Look at these little holes on it. What's the update, bud? Update is Wednesday, 26th. Did water in that thing? 30 a.m., yeah. In here? Woke up, slept in, making some coffee. It was a wet, miserable night. Wet, miserable day yesterday. Hiked in the rain for seven miles up the drainage here. Um, crawled up on this hill, found a couple flattish spots, and set up camp. And rain came in heavy and just hunkered us down. So we um, just had dinner and relaxed and rested up, but got up this morning, ran down to the creek, got water, and now I got a whole another storm rolling over the mountains right now, coming right at us. So I think the rest of this hunt's going to be pretty wet. And um, it's been a fun hunt, but haven't had much luck. Seen one ram basically, and eight days so out, damn you got the soul out Cisco oh, yeah, put it over me. <laughs> get that leak going on <laughs> just sold out eh sold bud out. anyway long story short it's wet it's cold there aren't any rams and uh take me home we're kind of <laughs> walking out of here with our tail between our legs at this point unless we get lucky and we got another three miles or so where we got the ability to take a ram if something were to present itself so cross our fingers and hope for the best and most importantly get out of here safe and back to our families so that's where we're at right now boys Ooh, I think this can's out. It's fully fogged up in here. Full steam bath. Mm -hmm. A little hot cup of joe and some breakfast, eh? It's mighty steamy in here now. Yeah, you let that, let that coffee brew. Mmm. Gotta get in on some of that. For about five minutes before you add the cream. And oh yeah, we bring creamer. Creamer? Creamer. You want to see the creamer? I'm hauling Cream a pound up, bud. and a half of creamer. Cream me up, bud. You ready right now? Yeah. You don't even want to let it nope. let it do its soap? Alright. Okay, buddy. I like my I like my coffee with cream. I like a little color there, <laughs> bud. I like this.
Just found a dead one. Just That's a skull. Good. That's crazy. What we got? We got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine at least, maybe ten down here. I wonder where the rest of his body is. Fuck, man. What? Oh, just that you'd find it. A dead one instead of a fucking. <laughs> I wonder where the rest of his body is. That's crazy. Oh, damn, he died at old age, dude. Look at those teeth, probably. Oh, yeah. No, maybe not. They're not ground down too much, huh? Oh, well, maybe they had a tough winter. No wonder we couldn't find any. Could be. <laughs> it's pretty cool, though, huh? Really cool. You can totally salvage that and fix it all up. Clean all that up, trim it, fucking re re I got that, uh... Huh, boys, what do you say? <laughs> we got a ride. We got a ride. Hey, boys, yeah. Scotty, what do you say, boss? Oh, so dude. Huh? Thank you. What do you Thank got? you, Lord. Thank you. Hard ramrod? You see a truck? Keep an eye out. Oh, Mystery <laughs> Ranch, boys. <laughs> Alaska Wild Project, boys. Right here from the Brooks Range, boys. James Dalton Highway. Oh. Come right from the old secret spot. Oh. <laughs> yeah. They made a parking old lot for it spot. nowadays. Yeah. Just chilling with the caribou here, bud. This little guy.